Hello my beautiful wolf pack. It is Christmas time. Once again, I am in my traditional Christmas robe. I have a belt that's slightly out of frame, but it's there. And I am here to wish you all a very happy holidays, whatever holiday it is that you celebrate, whether it's Christmas time, Hanukkah, Yule, there's a whole load of them that I actually don't know about either. But whatever it is you're celebrating, I hope you have a very happy and safe and welcoming, friendly, lovely holiday. I have a quick, fun little video for you today that I wanted to make and get up before Christmas. I just about squeezed it in. And more importantly, I want you to comment below and answer along to the questions that I'm asking today. Or should I say, a very special guest is asking today. And let me see and read all of your wonderful answers as well. To get us in the spirit, I'm gonna be answering some questions and telling you some of my favorite Christmas traditions, things, favorite things. What's other, another word for favorite? Okay, let's just get started. Santi, what questions do you have for me? Ho, ho, ho. What is your favorite Christmas film? My favorite Christmas film, I always used to say it was either Die Hard or Home Alone because they were the two I always watch around Christmas time. But my actual real answer is a film called Jack Frost, which I used to watch every year when I was a kid. It has uh, Michael Keaton in it. So I know there's loads of different forms of the film Jack Frost, but the one I'm talking about is Michael Keaton. And it's a snowman and a dad who dies and comes back into life. It's not, that's kind of spoilery. It's been out like donkey's years. So if you haven't seen it, just watch it. But the dad dies and comes back to life as a snowman to be there for his son. And it's a wonderful film. And I really, really recommend watching it if you haven't. That is my favorite Christmas film. Rudolph wants to know, what is the best present you've ever given? The best present I ever gave, it's tied between two different presents. And I like to give presents that are not but only meaningful, but really useful as well. Uh, the two I gave over the years that I think were the best I ever did was I got my dad a automatic car tire inflator. It's like, you know, the automatic pump that pumps up your car tires? Because we had a foot pump that you, you pressed with your foot over and over again and that's how we pumped up our car tires. And his knees were getting pretty sore over the years of doing it. And I saw that they had made these automatic ones so I bought one of them. And to this day he still refers to it as the best Christmas present he ever got. This one comes from Mrs. Claus. What is your favourite Christmas tradition? My favourite Christmas tradition that is unique to me but definitely is not unique to me is leaving all of my shopping to the last minute. I don't know why I've gotten so good at it, but it is three days to Christmas and I still have to buy presents for four of my family. I only have four members of my family. Yep, I'm really good at that. And on Christmas morning, what is the best present you've ever received? My favorite present I ever got in my whole life is the one that I really, really stand out. I think I was like eight or nine, something like that. And Santi brought me my first ever lot of horse riding equipment. Now bear in mind, I had nagged my parents to let me start horse riding. I was a horse mental kid. Like I was absolutely obsessed as a lot of little girls are. And I had been nagging them for a month to let me start horse riding. And they were worried it was too dangerous and I'd get hurt so they wouldn't let me start it. Eventually, towards the end of the summer, they let me start going to lessons. And for Christmas that year, Santi brought me my very own helmet and boots, I think it was, or maybe jod purse. But I remember having that and it, I was so excited because it meant I was like a real horse rider. And uh, there's definitely a, Christmas, a picture of me standing in front of the Christmas tree with like my new equipment. That was my absolute favorite Christmas present. It's the one I remember to this day. And finally, Harker, what is your one wish this Christmas? My Christmas wish is for everybody to comment below on this video and let me know what your answers to these questions are. I will type them and pin them in a comment below. And also, I wish for everyone to have a wonderful Christmas, a wonderful holidays, and a fantastic start to the new year in 2020. Thank you so much for supporting the channel this year. I really, really appreciate it. Um, all the views, the comments, the love, the interaction, the shares, the emails, everyone who came over to Twitch and watched my Twitch streams for the last while. We're doing loads of them over the holidays right up until New Year as well. So if you haven't already, do be sure to check out my Twitch channel in the link right here and in the description box below. But other than that, thank you so much for loving and watching and just being the best wolf pack and the best supporters in the world. Happy Christmas, happy holidays, and I will see you again very soon. And don't forget, hell to the moon for me.